Array is new for Alias 2014. With Array, you can create duplicates of one or more objects in a linear or radial pattern. Grills and wheels are ideal applications for Array. Here, I'll create a linear array as a pattern for a grill in this rear fascia. Go to Transform Array. Select the plane to work on and the mode. Select the objects to duplicate. In this case, these four curves. By clicking Build Now, with Auto Update checked, changes to the array will be displayed as they're made. Axis 1 represents the horizontal row. I'll start with 20. The surfaces I'll be working with are on the left side of vehicle, so I'll need a negative value for spacing. Axis 2 represents the vertical columns. I'll start with 20 for the number and spacing. In the rear view, I can make adjustments to the array to fit the boundary. For more visual interest, checking Stagger for Axis 2 offsets every other column half of the spacing value. Here I've completed the grill by trimming and adding draft surfaces to the openings created by the array. Radial mode creates an array in circular fashion. Radial controls the radius, and angular controls the radial rows. Using this circle, I'll start with the radial number of 4 and spacing of 150. Now, changing the angular number to 2 and the angle value to 45 degrees, I have two rows of four circles at 45 degrees. As the angular number is increased, Additional rows are created at 45 degree intervals. Fit to Circle takes control of the angle value and evenly distributes the number of radial rows within 360 degrees. In Control Options, Grow Radially fills the open spaces in the radial array and creates concentric rings. Changing the radial scale affects the rows in a linear way. Reducing the scale to 0.5 reduces the last object to 50% of the first object and averages the scale in between. Changing the angular scale affects the rows in a radial manner, starting with the axis row and moving counterclockwise. Experimentation with scale, offset, and stagger can produce some interesting results. For more information on Array, go to Alias Help.